Real Country, 1430 AM and 107.3 FM, WRDN. Brian Winnikins from World Dairy Expo. Thank you to our expo sponsors, including Elsevier Co-op, AMPI, Annabas Silo, BioVet, Bauer Seeds and Service, Animal Wellness Center of Buffalo Valley, and Dairy Farmers of Wisconsin. We are talking with Katrina Hosley today. She is a sustainability marketing specialist. Ooh. We're going to find out what all that means today. <laughs> and uh, Katrina, thanks for joining us. Well, part of this is what we're doing with Dairy Farmers of Wisconsin with our monthly Dairy Farmer Spotlight for consumers. So consumers can learn about our dairy farm families here in Wisconsin. And that's one of the big things DFW wanted to do this year. And that's exactly right. To many consumers, sustainability is at the forefront of what they're thinking about, and the research shows it. And this is a really good thing for our Wisconsin dairy farmers because they all have incredible stories to tell. They know that sustainability isn't anything new. It's what they have been doing and continue to do to keep their strong farm for a strong future. So we are here to help them tell their stories to connect with consumers. And, and really, that's, that's the big thing, not only working with farm media like myself, but also, though, to help give them other tools if they're out at the grocery store, because that, that can be the hard part. Here we are at the grocery store, and somebody comes up that they might know them from the high school basketball games or whatever, and they, well, I saw this on social media. What's going on? The dairy farmer is going to have some of these tools. Right, that's what we are here to do. We're here to support them as they tell their stories. And it's as simple as them telling what they do on their dairy farm. Starting that conversation with On My Farm and then talking about those different practices that they have. Everything from recycling water through a plate cooler up to creating renewable energy through biodigesters. Any uh, pillar of sustainability that they practice on their farm is a great wor story that is worth telling and one that we're here to support them as they tell through different resources that we have available for our farmers. Talking with uh, Katrina Hosley, she is a sustainability marketing specialist with Dairy Farmers of Wisconsin. I had a chance to talk with Katrina at World Dairy Expo. And, and you know what? That sustainability is also, we recycle the water, but it's other things like cover crops and, and, and using recyclable bedding and things like that that people may just not know about. That's what we're finding out, that consumers are telling us, well, we didn't know a farm's using water four times? We didn't. <laughs> How do they, we couldn't believe it when we learned how they did that. That It's stuff like that. Right, and the technology nowadays is beyond incredible. Helping farmers create that sustainable future so that they can have a strong farm for future generations. When you think about it, it's buffer crops, or it's cover crops, it's planting buffer strips, it is recycling water, and truly caring for their land, caring for their cows, preserving their water, and giving back to their communities. So that's the essence of sustainability and something that those farmers continue to do each and every day with new technology, bringing them into the future. Katrina, have you noticed as well, and, and you might not be on the buyer, you know, the, where you're talking with buyers from overseas, and, but have you noticed in conversations with the DFW staff that these buyers now have these same questions. What are your farmers doing? They do. I mean, anyone who has a connection to a Wisconsin dairy farmer, they're asking those questions. Um, and that's what we're here to do is give farmers the tools that they have in their toolbox so that when someone asks them, no matter what role that they play in the purchasing uh, process, they have those tools to then have that conversation and effectively tell their story. It's relevant, it's in the news right now, and it's something that our farmers are truly doing day in and day out to be sustainable for the future. Do, do you think that sustainability, that the, the meaning of that can be different for Wisconsin dairy farmers? Those in the Southwest might have a different definition, quote unquote, to those in the southeast or in the northwest or in the northeast. Did, did, have you seen that or do, do you recognize that or not? See, Wisconsin is America's dairy land. We're known for raising dairy cows and we're like the perfect spot to be dairying. So our farmers, we're hoping to become the leader in dairy sustainability and a place for people of all types to come and look for those resources of what dairy farming sustainability truly means. So here in Wisconsin, we hope to lead the way in those initiatives as we go forward, putting out consumer uh, information and resources through our dairy farmers. So for dairy farmers that want to maybe learn more, how can they, how can they get these tools? Simply reach out. We can be found with our resources at dairy, uh, wisconsindairy.org backslash sustainability or simply DM us on one of our social media pages. Send us an email. We are here to serve you. So any questions that you have, reach out. We'd be happy to give you as many resources as you need to be effective in telling your story.
And when you reach out, you might be end up talking to her as well. So <laughs> think of that as well. And again, you'll be able to find, um, we'll be doing another uh, Dairy Farm Family Spotlight here coming up at the end of October. That last full week of the month is when we do our Dairy Farm Spotlights. You can not only see those on our YouTube channel as well after we air them on the radio, but also DFW shares them too as well. So you can check out uh, some of our past uh, Dairy Farm family spotlights that we've done here on WRDN as well. We're from uh, the World Dairy Expo. I'm Brian Winnikins on WRDN.